what's up guys out here with the tracks of sledge uh, this time she's got a couple m2c racing or uh, prototype pop-ups on it uh, in my opinion the weakest point on this truck was the motor mount and center diff situation and also we have some awesome uh, hex extenders right here with a nice lug on it i mean it's a straight up 7075 lug nut which looks absolutely awesome with the m2c racing uh, name on there this is a six and a half millimeter extension so you got 13 millimeters wider all the way together to give her that awesome stance again i'm running uh, armor backflips uh the regular to boot backflips on here Here's a quick shot of the motor mount. Beautiful 7075 work. Uh, it's one piece design. Then you got your center diff uh, mount right here. You got a slide right here for your motor that you can adjust your mesh from the top. And once you get your mesh set, you can lock it in with that screw right there to really help uh, keep it from moving. So it's an awesome design by M2C Racing. Here's a quick shot of the inside, guys, uh, with the M2C motor mount and also this ESC top plate. These are all prototype parts, guys. We're going to have to do some extreme testing on this and may make a few changes. But anyway, it definitely allows for a stronger mount system because it locks the center diff and the motor together. Being the stock center diff was plastic and separated from the actual motor mount, any kind of chassis uh, flexing or twisting, of course, you're going to lose your mesh and you could also break off gears on your spur gear, which is what I did on the first run with this truck. I'm still running the stock motor. I just strapped on a Hobby Star fan right there. Again, I'm running the Max 6 in here now. This thing has loads of power now with this Max 6 in it. Plus, I'm running 1746 gearing, which is overkill gearing for this truck. Uh, it's a really hot setup, so I wouldn't recommend it. Uh, 1546 would probably be better. The uh, stock spur is a 51 tooth, I believe, and I dropped down to the 46. So uh, it's, it's basically the same as running like a 20 tooth with the stock spur, the setup I got right here. Again, it's a, it's a uh, 1746 gearing, but I'll just have to give her some cool downs, but I just really love the power and speed this thing has. You might notice an Arma shock on the back right here. I did bust a shock cap and I didn't have any replacements. So I just had to stick an Arma Creighton uh, shock on here. It's a little bit shorter. So I just adjusted these uh, droop screws that I added in on all four corners to uh, hone in on the droop on this truck because it doesn't come with them stock. And also added in a rubber bump stop right there because on really hard landings, the arms were flexing too much because of the shock compressing too much and it was popping the drive shafts out. So hopefully that's gonna, that's gonna stop that problem. All right guys, I'm on 6S of course. We're gonna give her a quick run out here and see what's up. A little nose heavy on that one. That was a little harsh. guys looks like we have some rain moving in it's been some crazy weather here lately got a pretty dark cloud right above me but looks like rain that way so we're just gonna go ahead and send it a couple times while we can <laughs> that's the first body ejection with the sledge well guys we just had a freak rain roll in it's crazy this time of year to all these isolated storms and stuff it's still sprinkling right now but i don't have a whole lot of time left i'm gonna try to do a few more jumps while i can Oh, that uh, must have popped a motor lead loose. <laughs> that was a close call. <laughs> I 
Body ejection. Looks like she's taking after her big brother, X Max. All right, guys, came out to a new spot. I got totally ran out yesterday. We're gonna hit up another construction site. Uh, so far, the MTC motor mount is holding up perfect. The uh, mesh is holding tight. Haven't had an issue with anything budging or the mesh shifting. And also these awesome M2C uh, hex extenders. Again, they're 6.5 millimeter extension. And I just love this uh, single lug right here. It's just so sweet, looks really cool. All right, guys, let's rip it around. I can barely see it for the dust. Oh, that was close <laughs> guys this thing has tons of power now just put in this max six in it made a huge difference 